Kurosama had never come between us, I still would have been defeated by those eyes. Such a deep fury. Is he a man? Or is he a demon? I can't believe it! Okusama has asked me to take the journey with her! <laughs> See, you never know about old people! I guess she hasn't got senile just yet! <laughs> I'll shut up. Smart. Of course, I will be coming back with a gift for you. What do you want it to be? A nice new hair ornament? Or perhaps the finest sash strap the seamstresses have to offer? <laughs> I'm a ninja girl. I don't think I could use any of those things. Hoda Ruby. You can't train every second of every day. There's always time to be a woman. Just look at Obero-sama. <laughs> Wait, where are you going? Someplace... The no hostilities pact is a good thing, I believe. I believe it when I look at you, my love. Yashimaru, don't know. These are the most beautiful hands. I never want to see blood on them. I will never forgive them. We should go now, but we should head back separately. Yes. Is something wrong? 
It's nothing. I have a question for you. It's about Obura-sama. What do you think of her? Genosuke has resolved to part ways with the Iga and with Obura-sama. That leaves the responsibility resting on her shoulders to feel the same about him. Obura-sama must help us. We need her to make sure that Genosuke is dead before he reaches Sunpu. I am deeply sorrowful for what she must endure. As a woman, I know her pain, and truth be told, I pity her. My wish is for her to one day truly forget about Genosuke, but I don't know if it is in her to do what is necessary. That is where I agree with you. I thought... I thought I knew every expression over Osama's face had to offer. From happy to sad, fearful to angry, I was wrong. With him, I had never seen an expression on her face like when she was with him. Looks like I finally caught up to you, Hodoru. I've got good news for you. I managed to wipe out Genesuke along with all the others. 